Hey guys, welcome back to another YouTube video. And today we are going to be reviewing the NYC 2020 Beach Head G.I. Joe Retro Toys figure. Um, as you know by my Mr. Potato Head pop review, um, if you haven't checked it out, um, go check it out. Just go in my saddle and look for it. Um, as you know, the Retro Toys line is a new line, um, so there's not many pops in it. Mr. Potato Head was number two. So, um, yeah, we are going to be reviewing the NYCC 2020 Beach Head Pop. Um, just got this one at Target, um, so that's why I'm doing this video. So, um, yeah, before we get into this, please like and subscribe and hit the notification bell if you haven't already. It really helps the channel out. So let's get started. So boom, Beach Head Pop. So this is a character from Z.I. Joe. He's wearing like a green ski mask. He has something that goes boom, boom. I don't want to say it. You never know what YouTube will do. <laughs> um, so technically he's in lots of green. He, he, he's Retro Toys, number 13. And he's from the Z.I. Joe part of Retro Toys. As you see, the side of the box is similar. Um, like it says, it says all the things. And that shows, like, um, a thing that they would, like, the character in G.I. Joe. Let's get a closer look at him. So, yeah, it's like, that, there he is. <laughs> I'm not sure. Um, so, yeah, let's take him out of the box. So here is Beats Head out of the box. Um, for this video, uh, I'm gonna get a bit closer for the camera, so let's do that right now. Okay, guys, sorry I couldn't do that. Um, I tried. Um, I'm gonna be trying for up next videos in the future, but I just couldn't do that. So let's look at him up close. So I still have to like touch it and then like get more close to the camera. So as you see, he has his it's like kind of dark. It's just a normal green color ski mask with like lines like a normal ski mask would. He has mad eyebrows, it looks like. He has like little ears that are covered up by the um mask. Um, not much to see on the head. So, yeah, let's move on to the body. So, as you see on the body, he has a thing that goes boom boom on him. Um, he has like a kind of green sweater to go with like the green um. I totally forgot what it was called. Sorry, guys. Um, whatever. Um, he has the thing that goes boom, boom, like I said. He has, like, a little, like, bulletproof jacket on. Um, YouTube, please don't demonetize me. Um, it looks like he has the things to let the gun go boom, boom. He has camo pants. And then he has some black boots on. So, yeah, let's go on to the compare. <laughs> Sorry, guys, it won't focus. Okay, there we go. Sorry, got A's for that. Um, let's move on to the comparison. Okay, guys, right now there's a picture up of the screen of Will Beats Head. Um, I'm looking at one of the toys because it's part of the retro toy line. And I just thought, like, probably more based off of the toy than, like, you know, like, the, um, the TV show version of him. So, as you see, he has a ski mask on. On that one, he has, a, you can kind of see a nose and a mouth, it looks like, but. Never mind, you can't see a nose. I didn't notice that. Um, He has a nose under the ski mask. But, of course, like, they don't do mouths on Funko Pops usually, especially if they're human characters. I know when I said that, I have, like, a whole, I have a few Pops in my background that have mouths. I was like, yeah, I need to correct that. <laughs> So, um, yeah, his thing that goes boom, boom looks good. Yeah, it looks like the figure. Um, he has his camo pants. On that one, it has a darker shade of camo, so darker brown and darker green. But you never know the differences between the figures. So, like, you never know. He has the black gloves on, like he has in that. He has, like, the vest that's bulletproof, I'm really sure. Um, 
So yeah, um, wait a second. Well, if you turn him around, yeah, if you turn, he's not standing. Um, so if you turn him around, he has like a little thing on the back of him. As you can see on the figure, it looks like he has one. As you can kind of see like it appearing behind his head. They cannot do that as a Funko Pop due to his head being so massive. Um, so yeah, they have the same expression of eyebrows too. So, um, yeah, let's move on to the end. So yeah, that's the end of the video. Before you leave, please like and subscribe and hit the notification bell if you haven't already. It notifies you when a new video comes out. Please comment down below two things. What's your favorite G.I. Joe character? And second, if you liked the thing, like how I made it get closed up for the comparison, tell me if you want to see it more or tell me just no. Um, I'll figure out a different way. So, um, yeah, that's the end of the video. And bye.